We are now going to answer this past exam question is VCAR 2016, paper one, question five. And it says, consider the planar graph below, which of the following graphs can be redrawn as the planar graph above. So we need to figure out, you know, what is this iso, or what is the equivalent graph to this? So which of these are isomorphic? So remember what we need to consider is that it needs to have the same edges, the same vertices and the same amount of connections. So let's talk about the same amount of edges first. So how many, uh, let's actually begin by vertices. Vertices is way easier to check, isn't it? Vertices. How many vertices does this have? One, two, three, four, five. So now I can come down here. Which of these can I eliminate? One, two, three, four, five. All of these have five, five vertices, don't they? So that is no help to me. All of these have five vertices. So the next thing that you would want to check is you know that isomorphic graphs must have the same amount of edges. So how many edges do I have here? Edges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight edges. So let's see how many edges each of these has. So here we have one, two, count it this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this could pen potentially be right because this is eight edges. Uh, now, be smart about this. Do I need to recount this all again? Well, no, because I clearly have five here, and now I just have one, two, three, four. So I have four on the outside, so that means I have nine edges. Edges is equal to nine. Because as you can see here, I had like three on the outside, now I have uh, one more on the outside. So you don't have to count them up each time, otherwise you will be wasting time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, you can, but it's what makes it quicker. So hopefully you can look at this and immediately say, well, you know, this looks like this. It's just, you know, instead of having nothing there, I have nothing there. So this one also has nine edges. This one, well, how many does this one have? Well, th this one had eight because I had one, two, three on the outside. This only has two on the outside. So it has, it's seven. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Last one. Well, this one has how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That one has seven. Edges seven. Now this is fantastic. And the reason why it's fantastic is because only one of them has eight edges. So that means this has to be the answer, doesn't it? This has to be the answer. We don't have to check whether the connections are the same between them. Uh, because this is the only one with eight edges. So it has to be the isomorphic with that one. They have to, these have to be equivalent graphs because they have the same amount of vertices, the same amount of edges, and the other ones don't even have the same amount of edges. So the only one that has the potential to be isomorphic is this one. So we can say that our answer is A and we can keep on moving. If we see how many people got this correct, this is question five. Question five, 58% of people got that one correct. Uh, so, you know, a good amount of people struggled with that question. All right, I'll see you in the next one.